tight. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Ross Patterson Revolution. Brought to you by GhostBed.com. And look, starts and out you're... so innocent. The sun's shining. Kids are running around. We're drinking. Birds... We're starting early, ending early. Yeah, birds are punching each other in the <laughs> face. And, you know, so, then you wake yeah. up with a, a sore asshole around so, 4 a.m. And you, you can't remember anything. You got a, you know, so a, this a is sparkler you in your hand that's halfway lit. There's a hot pocket still in the goddamn toaster oven. And you're like, what, what happened? That was 4th of July. Right. Brother. That was day drinking. That any was day, day drink, drinking. Any day drinking holiday. Yeah. Um, and so people make fun of me. Oh, you're drinking red wine in the summer. And I'm like, I have through trial and error, you fucking loser. Yeah. Through trial and error, I have figured out the combo that gets me to a place that isn't. It's comfortable. Right. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? No, I that get it. It doesn't disintegrate into me in a ditch with, you know, my shoes as earrings. Yeah, yeah. No, I, know, get, I, I get all walking that. Down. So that's what I figured out. Uh-huh. And even white wine will get, if I, if I stray from that at all. And again, this is just such a cool thing about me. Sure. And I don't want to brag about my partying, you know, yeah, 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 abilities, yeah, yeah. but I cannot drink more than three glasses of red wine. And that is all. Well, look, I'm going to be realsies with you here. We've talked about, uh, we've talked about the Kyle, uh, I, don't, I want to say phenomenon that's taking over the world, monster energies and punching through drywall. Right. I've punched drywall before. Every single time was on Jim Beam. <laughs> Dead serious. Every single time. Starting before, yep. when you start drinking the Jim Beam, like before three o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here's the... Here's kind of the lay of the loo, if you will, for Jim Beam. There's the shitty whiskey that is Southern Comfort. I cannot get down on that whatsoever, right? It's got a sweet smell. Yeah. Smells like puke, yeah. Sweet smell. Yeah. Sweet smell. Um, can't Soak get... on lime. You want to soak on lime? Nope. Okay. Never. I never want one, you know, after having one. Even saying the word SoCo, every single person who's listening at home or watching this on YouTube a little smells bit puke. it. You, you smell it. You already know it. You're like, oh, fuck. A little bit God puke. God damn it. Up. I smell SoCo right now as you're talking about it, right? Then the step up from that is Jim Beam, where you're like, ah, all right. It's not, it's not the most expensive. And then just, just beyond that is Jack Daniels. Right. Just just beyond that, when you start getting into Buffalo Trace and the other fucking bullshit that's super expensive. Right. You just wrote off about 90 percent of America. And congratulations if you're able to drink that. Um, we, we are. But a lot of people aren't. Right. Sure. And that's the problem with this factory burning down is that's 40,000 gallons that were going out to America. That's their mid range whiskey that your your chances are your butt fucking on. Right. Right. The people I so really are we saying the butt fucking that's going to go down. It's going to go down this year, and the people I feel for are the people who were like, man, they woke up this morning and they were like, man, I'm going to hit the liquor store, get some Jim Beam, get on my my uncle's boat because he's out of town, and then probably <laughs> butt fuck someone. On <laughs> my uncle's dinghy, gone. I'm going to get ten to twelve people on yeah, there. <laughs> I'm going to go to Havasu, brother, and I'm going to butt fuck. Now, I, forty thousand. Barrels of it, man. It's not gallons. It's barrels. That's another Kyle thing is Havasu. Ooh, oh, yeah. Havasu. Just Havasu. Yeah. If you know, you're a Kyle. If you know, you know, right? <laughs> if you know, you know. But with this 40,000 barrels gone, I'd, I'd say you probably eliminated... Uh, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go soft estimate here. 12,000 people that aren't going to butt fuck on the 4th of July. That's a soft, very soft estimate. I'm going to say butt sex. Something uh, about butt. Oh, butt fuck? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Look, people aren't tuning into this show uh, to hear the ABCs, you know, the onesie twosies of life. Right, but I don't think they're tuning in to hear a gal say butt fuck <laughs> over and over. <laughs> Bye.